What's up everyone? Pasay Baller here. We are now in this second game for today, January 2, 2024 NBA Game Day. This is going to be a wild uh, matchup. Um, this is a battle of two teams who are actually both doing great in this season. And this is the battle between Boston Celtics and OKC Thunder. That'll happen at 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. So that's going to be 9 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pasay Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. Approaching this game, man, uh, Boston Celtics, they got a record of 26-6. But for OKC Thunder, they have a record of 22-9. and Just like what I said, both teams are doing great. As we all know, we actually provide free picks right here in our YouTube channel, Pase Baller. But for those who would want to avail our premium picks or premium packages, you may actually reach us through our Instagram, Telegram, WhatsApp, or even Messenger accounts. Just check on the descriptions of these videos and you can actually see the details right there. The spread that is given is at minus 2.5 and that's given towards Boston Celtics. The OKC Thunder, they would have the home court advantage on this. In terms of momentum, well, both teams are actually having uh, good momentum approaching this game. But i got to say that um, it is Boston Celtics who would have uh, an advantage over OKC. Why? Approaching this game, they are on a six-game winning streak. And on their last 10 games, they have actually won nine. Now, don't get, don't get me wrong. Just like what I said, OKC Thunder, they are also doing great. Approaching this game, they are on a four-game lo uh, not losing, four-game winning streak. And for their last 10 games, OKC Thunder, they have actually won 8. So again, both teams are doing great. Both teams are having some momentum. But Boston Celtics should be having um, a slight advantage over OKC because of the kind of record that they have. Man, they are number 1 in the entire NBA in the standings. Now in terms of fatigue, both teams are coming off rest. We can just skip that part. In terms of, um, in terms of health and availability, this is cool, man. Both teams. And yeah. Both teams, right now, I'm actually checking, I actually checked on it. No one is actually listed in IL. No one is suspended whatsoever. So uh, both teams are going to go into this battle full packed. So this is going to be great. All right, so again, the spread that is given is minus 2.5. That's uh, for Boston Celtics. Obviously, OKC Thunder, um, they would be, uh, for sure, they would be getting the, the support of their crowd. Um, they are one of the best right now. I'm talking about OKC going up against the best in the NBA in terms of uh, the standings. Um, this is going to be great. OKC Thunder, they are actually doing great in terms of their offense. Actually, both teams um, are some of the best um, offensive uh, offensive players in the entire NBA. You can check the numbers on that. But uh, this may be tough, especially, again, both teams are just monsters. But I'm going to side with Boston Celtics here. Uh, and I have like a, I have like a, a three reasons for that. Number one, Boston Celtics um, they have uh, they have actually gotten that record with twenty six and six with some injuries at, you know uh, at hand. Now right now on this particular game, all of their players are actually available, so they're they're, they're scary. You know they are scary. Porzingis would be there. Tatum and Brown would be there. Holiday will be there. So it's just going to be a different Boston Celtics whenever they are complete. Number two, uh, just like when I said, both teams are, 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 best, are some of the best offensive teams right now in the NBA, right? But Boston Celtics, they are number one in terms of the rebound. So that's, you know, that's going to catapult them or that's just going to give them an extra, you know, an extra advantage over whichever team it is because rebounding actually provides you more opportunities and opportunities gives you success. So um, for me, Boston Celtics, that's, that's, that's going to be one of the key factors that can actually give them this win. And lastly, Boston Celtics, they are the more experienced team on it. So um, it's going to go against the OKC's comfort and, uh, comfort and advantage in terms of them being at home. Boston Celtics, they've been through that. They've been through a lot of shit, you know. Um, and it's not like Boston Celtics is like an old team, right? Except for Horford. Um, but, yeah, Boston Celtics, they've been through. Uh, they've been on the road. Uh, and they have actually won huge games on the road. So I'm going to side with Boston Celtics in here. 
the spread is not that much anyway, so I feel like they can actually cover that. I'm expecting a huge game from Tatum right after that huge performance that he had against San Antonio Spurs. So again, my pick would be Boston Celtics minus 2.5. Celtics minus 2.5. Peace out. Pase love. God bless.